the Ukrainian armed forces have continued their unsuccessful attempts to conduct offensive operations in South Donetsk, Zaporizhzhia, and Donetsk directions during the previous 24 hours. Four attacks launched by AFU motorized infantry units reinforced by tanks were repelled by skillful and coordinated actions of the Vostok Group of Forces, Aviation, Artillery, and Heavy Flamethrowers in Vremevka's salient and Orhov tactical direction. Three tanks and five armored fighting vehicles have been destroyed, said Lieutenant General Igor Konoshenkov, the Russian Federation Defense Ministry spokesman. In addition, four clusters of enemy manpower and equipment were engaged near Novopol, Donetsk People's Republic, and Levadnoi, Zaporizhia region. In Pology tactical direction, actions of one sabotage and reconnaissance group of the armed forces of Ukraine have been thwarted near Reshetilovskoye, Zaporizhia region. Total enemy losses in the South Donetsk and Zaporizhia directions overnight were up to 260 Ukrainian servicemen, 9 tanks, a Bradley infantry fighting vehicle, 12 armored fighting vehicles, 3 motor vehicles, 2 D-20 howitzers, 2 M's to B howitzers, as well as a US-made M777 artillery system. Operational tactical and army aviation, missile troops and artillery of the Russian group of forces have engaged 98 AFU artillery units at their fire positions. Ammon power and military hardware in 112 areas were under fire during the day, said Lieutenant General Igor Konoshenkov, the Russian Federation Defense Ministry spokesman. The other side from Kyiv, the armed forces of Ukraine in an official statement June 21 said Russia lost 540 servicemen in a single day, including nine tanks, 21 armored fighting vehicles as well as 32 artillery units and 35 drones. In total, Moscow have been losing 222,000 servicemen since their launching full-scale aggression into Ukrainian territories. In some areas our warriors are moving forward, in some areas they are defending their positions and resisting the occupiers' assaults and intensified attacks. We have no lost positions, said Volodymyr Zelensky the president of Ukraine. Russia and Ukraine conflict has been lasting for 482 days. There is still no peace settlement between two sides. Ukraine, I thank each of our soldiers who are now in the fight, on the posts, on the posts, on the posts. Zaporizhia, Donetsk, you guys are great. Thank you to everyone who trains our soldiers and who helps us with the weapons. Each one of the weapons, every one of the weapons of Ukraine використовуємо максимально ефективно і завжди для захисту життя. Слава Україні! Тримо вас і сюди нонтон! Дякую за лайк, підписку і шерію!